Welcome back to Rising, I'm Adam Worsell. Have you seen the traders? Maybe you have. If you haven't, it's one of the most successful reality competition series to ever stream anywhere. And recently, I got to sit down with one of the stars of the show, Sandra Diaz-Twine. Take a look. Sandra, we did like a family feud show together a few years ago in, in Kansas. We did, and I won, and I was so happy. Uh, I was like, oh my God, it's the first time I win something. I wish it was like a huge uh, money prize, but it wasn't, but I still took home the title, and I was excited about it. That was so much fun. We should do that again. Uh, the queen stays queen, no matter if she's on Survivor or a Family Feud show in Topeka, Kansas, or on The Traders. Tell us about this crazy show for the people that haven't seen it yet. You have to tune in, it's so good. And people always have their fan favorites from shows across, um, you know, like The Bachelor and The Housewives and Survivor, Big Brother, all the big names. There's a lot of heavy hitters out there and we're just destroying and turning this castle inside out as we get murdered or banished and it's really good. Now, I'm, I'm a huge fan of this show and in one of the round tables, I mean, you couldn't even take a drink of water without being accused. How intense is it in that room? Oh my God, it's so awful. Not just in that room, just the whole entire day from going to breakfast and trying to figure out who got murdered to who's doing the murdering to then spending the day trying to figure out who these traitors are. Uh, everything you say and do is under scrutiny. I mean, I couldn't even, like you said, take a sip of water without being called a traitor and it was crazy, but it was good TV. Sandra, let's talk about a few of the challenges because you sell admittedly are not the biggest fan of the physical competitions you've said that many times on survivor how tough were these challenges i mean even you I mean you're lifting things you're going uphill trying to carry things i mean this is intense it was and as a matter of fact i was like okay if i could do survivor i could do the traders i'm not going to be scared of these missions and oh my god they were horrible so it's like whoever made up these missions <laughs> might have worked for survivor in the past i mean they were hard but everyone took it in stride we did our best and of course um i left with a couple of bruises and there's still more to come we are so proud to have you on Rising. The Queen stays queen right here in the Queen City of Charlotte. Uh, you can watch Sandra Diaz twine on The Traitors Airs tonight on Peacock. And Sandra, I've been practicing it. The Traitors. The Traitors. How'd I do? You did good. Actually, if he ever needs, if Alan ever needs a stand-in, you do an awesome job. And I wanted to say, too, that I don't know if the viewers know this, but I live in Fayetteville, North Carolina. Look at that. We, I didn't even realize. That's amazing. We got we to gotta, we gotta get drinks or hang out sometime. Absolutely. Thanks so much, Sandra. Thank you, Adam. Take care. Bye. The traitors, huh? Oh, well, it yeah. seems good. Yeah. I, do you like a survivor type? I like, yeah, I really like the competition. Show? Yeah, for sure. Yeah. So, like, the, you know, especially that show because it's, you know, competition, right? Mm -hmm. But then it's also the social game aspect of it, too. Yeah. How about you? And you have to wonder if people yeah. are just playing the game kind right. of or, or what they're doing. Yeah. Uh, I do, yeah. I like, I liked, um, Oh, what was it called? Fear Factor. Fear Factor was so good. I like a competition show like this. Yeah. Oh, so fun. good. There was one episode of Fear Factor, yeah. uh, quickly, yeah. uh, they had to eat a live spider. Ugh, disgusting. Yeah, it was, uh, it was awful. awful. Yeah, um, I'll, I'll send you that link later. Right. <laughs> Time now is 8.48. Uh, we're going to head on over to Nicole.